Well, here we go. Bloodstained Ritual of the Night. Of course, this is the demo E3 version, as you can see. Available via Steam through Kickstarter. But I believe it's only available to Kickstarter backers, uh, or unless you've received some kind of special code. Perhaps if you visited E3 or some such. Anyway, I haven't checked that out at all yet. Let's jump right in. Is it is it disappointing that I can't play with the loading screen already? I kick things, so that's always a plus. Okay, cool. There's a map. Very looks good. Yeah, I figured that out already. <laughs> it's Ecovania, it's not fucking uh, something completely unfamiliar, right? Of course, this is using the, I believe, Unreal 4 engine. So it's running quite well. Fucking weapons, look at that shit. Maybe if I was paying attention, I'd have realized it. No shards, I guess shards are spells. Which is cool with me. Have potions. And only potions. That's fine. Fucking somebody released a kraken apparently. Endless merman type enemies. Ah, oh, you fucking piece of shit. Of course, we got to climb up here and see what's going on. What do you got for me? Leather breastplate. I kind of like what they've done with the shaders, with the uh, cell shading kind of look. It's not the one that I personally voted for. Um, I actually I think I went with uh, shader number one, as it was in the backer vote. But uh, this is fine. Looks nice. It's, it gives it a nice feel. Oh, motherfucker! Yeah, yeah, expected that. You son of a bitch. there for a second. <laughs> they could have give it a smoother transition, but and they leveled up. It would be kind of cool. Oh, never mind. You can actually see that I put a headband on. Alright, I was going to say. I'm clearly wrong about that. Amy! What the hell are you doing to the ship, Amy? our demo. They throw a hundred bucks at us and tell us to shut the hell up. No, it's not. Fly feels a little short, but uh, not bad. That looks like a perfect spot to break a wall. But this is just a demo, so let's we'll see how that goes. I don't even know why I'm breaking every freaking lantern. It's not like I have any abilities to use or parts or whatever to pick up. Whoa! 
I just got impaled by a crystal. It's just a flame from a demon possessed cannon. Sounds pretty rad. Light the cannon fuse with the obtained shard. Okay, let's see. Equipment. fashion, they must have some kind of explosive. <laughs> Break open a wall. It's fine by me. Oh, I do like that we have the downward diagonal strike as well as the horizontal. Hi, viewer. How you doing? You've been in, like, every Castlevania game since fucking forever. Multi-legged lion head guy? Kind of weird, but... Nonetheless, a welcome addition. And I know, I keep calling it Castlevania. It is not. Because fuck Konami. stick feels a little bit sensitive to the down direction. I'm playing on a 360 controller right now because the game requires something with X input. Um, I will give it a try with my Steam controller in a bit. See what goes on there. Okay, apparently those guys have exactly 12 health. They're like the frickin' uh, dragon skulls or whatever. strike from what I can see. That's fine. Let's see, this is going to be a vertical, which I can explore. And it's a good thing. Oh, we got Kung Fu shoes. Sounds awesome. Assuming that's accessory. <laughs> Looks like I have two weapon slots, but I think I can only use one. Well, let's go to Kung Fu shoes. Alright, we can rock this. It's fine. Hmm, did miss a section back there, but that's... that's okay. We got Kung Fu shoes, it doesn't fucking matter anymore. Styling and kicking ass. Which is, of course, the most important way to kick ass. Oh, you cocksucker. Apparently. Apparently, it works better than a fucking sword. I would have thought some orange slippers would do the trick. Hmm. Obviously, 
obviously going to be some way to get up there. Later iterations. Oh! Constitution booster. Automatically activate buffs by attaching a shard. Yes, sounds good. Constitution more. Okay, it's already made, already equipped. That's good. Increases con, which is basically defense and or hit points. I don't know how they're making it work this time. Oh, there's another one. Keep getting impaled with shards. It's really a splash. Shards appears with Seema's power. She's a whirlpool. Trigger shard. Magic attack toward facing direction consumes MP. Oh, you don't see. Who the fuck? Okay, okay, it's a little splashy, blurby thing. Yeah, there's that. Nothing spectacular. Another potion I don't need yet. Always good to have. Oh, hell no, dude. I'm on to your game. Here at all? Let's see. That's what I thought, punk. Door. And this looks like a secret ish room. High potion, okay. High ether, okay. We can surmise what the ether does. It's the not health potion. Ah, you fucking punk. Good, good level up. Doesn't seem like your health changes though when you level up, which is interesting. That's probably uh, something that's gonna happen to the boss mechanics. This way. What's up here? What we got? Nothing. It's fine. There will be something later, just not right now. goes up. That's pretty important. Ah! I hear my Discord pinging in the background. I'll tell you what, the soundtrack fits right at home. Keep there. And a ring! There's our accessory. Cheap ring. Well, it can't be that fucking cheap. It increases my defense by two. Probably should have checked that earlier, but that's okay. Now that I have a shortcut on the way back. A meaningful shortcut, mind you. My guy's wind up isn't too long. Just long enough to uh, keep time to get the fuck out of the way. Alright, let's go. Take 
on that boss. With Kung Fu, choose. Oh, I guess that was important. Head flail. <laughs> Uses the head of the Headless Knight as a flail. All right, let's let's see what that's all about. Because it seems like it might be stronger. And it's the only one we have a double of. That'd be cost 12, power 19. So it's stronger for certain. No, that's not it. Oh. Oh yeah. <laughs> Dig it. I've already checked everything else. Might as well pop a potion. We got four of them. Time. Gotta be the shoes, man. What in the? I didn't expect uh, giant boobies, but you know, whatever. Are ginormous boobies. Thank you for allowing me to play. I enjoyed it and I really look forward to seeing what comes next. Well, I will say the artwork icon seems a little bit too much fuchsia, but that's a personal preference. Otherwise, quite well. Quite well done. Thanks guys for watching, good luck, good hunting.